Welcome back, summoners. MBR here. Can you bring some Ari gameplay in the mid lane? What a sexy lady she is. And this is actually the first time I've uploaded a video of her onto the channel. I may be wrong. I might have done a video a long time ago, but it's a, she's a champion that's never really appealed to me too much. Um, mid lane's not the greatest lane that I've. You know, I haven't played the most amount of champions in mid lane. You know, I've played everyone sort of once, but sort of any champions I've ever really stuck with are sort of like Lux. Quite really enjoyed in the mid lane. Really enjoyed Cinder recently. Quite enjoyed Oriana and some champs like that. Um, but Ari's never been a champion that appealed to me too much. But I played a game the other day where she was just really fair and looked OP. So I thought, well, we'll give it a whirl and see if I can be as good. <laughs> um, so I played her a couple times in the past, but you know, not a great deal. Um, well, a quick read up on my moves. I have a feeling my Q does tree damage on a return bounce or something. So anyway, let's have a look. Gains a charge of essence whenever a spell hits an enemy. Upon reaching nine charges, Ari's next spell heals. Heals for a hell of a lot. <laughs> uh, the Q deals 40 magic damage on the way out and 40 true damage on the way back. So, you know, that it doesn't matter if he has 10,000 magic resist. That true damage is still going to be hitting for that full amount, which is really nice. So, you obviously, you want to be trying to hit those return Qs or hitting the Q in the first place would be nice. <laughs> Let alone return Q. Um, my W releases three fox eyes that lock onto an enemy champion. And he's hit with multiple fox eyes. Take... 30% damage from each one for a maximum, and then obviously my charm. Loads of kiss to walk harmlessly towards the Ari. Enemies hit by charm take 20% more damage. Was the suction tree damage is increased by this effect? Ah, so we want to really be landing our charm before we do anything else. That's pretty important to know. And then obviously my ultimate can be cast up three times. So yeah, we'll see. Um, not sure what to scale up first. Or oh, I, I scale up my um, I scale up my Q. We have Janna. Okay. Um, just trying to get owned by a Janna in the middle. Oh, we're not gonna get a minion. Um, okay, that's interesting. We'll see. I, so I'm not sure where to go for my Q. Uh, my W, my E next. Um, or to scale upwards. My W, I guess, to do more damage. But I don't know if the charm's gonna last, you know, longer or. What. Here we go, going for the first, or oh, I was going to go for the first Q. Nice, we get these minions first though. Here we go, here we go. Oh, that was terrible. I should have just stopped in the first place. <laughs> Theory me. That was, that was the best Q EUS. Signs of things to come right there. Uh, at least we hit the first bounce. I might just go for my, I don't know, I might take Charm just in case Riven Ganks. You know, we're not really pushing, but at least we have Charm, we can... Riven's not really the greatest jungler in my opinion. Um, it's you know, quite hard for her to get on top of people really. She has to burn all her abilities to do that. But you know, at least we have her there and not really making any use of my W just yet. Probably should be trying to use my Q a bit more to harass her. Um, just don't want to fail. Every time you fail a Q, you know, it's just wasted mana. I think we hit her then. Um, obviously Q's not doing a great deal because we're only level 2 at the moment. That's cool. You get the big minion, that's the question. That is, oh my god. Should have queued it. I was trying to be greedy. I was like, nah, we, we, we can get that with an auto attack. And clearly, it was clearly proven that we could not. Riven, how's she doing? The interesting matchup versus Lulu. Once Riven gets on top of her, she can do some nice damage, but at the same time, Lulu just polymorph her and it's, you know, GG. Well, it's me versus Janna, I don't know. I've not seen a Janna in mid for a while. Um, She is so extended. Oh no, so far away. So far away, GG to Riven. She's just going to flash over the wall, I imagine now. Um, it was unfortunate, I was trying to keep hold of my charm and then I thought we might be able to make it and it was just too far away in the end. That, uh, is Riven going to, I think we can close the gap, she's just so fast, she's away. What a waste amount of time that was. He burnt my knight. I thought we made the super play. Probably should have charmed her a, a bit sooner. I was trying to make sure that I held on to my charm just so that we, you know, she didn't uh, um, escape. Um, or that I didn't miss my charms. But in the end, you know, we, let, we held on it for too long. And then when I did decide for her, I knew I was out of range. But I was just kind of hoping for the best. And I could have flashed. But at the same time, I thought, you know, Ruben might be able to get there a little bit sooner. And we wouldn't have needed to. And by the time I would have decided to flash, it would have been way too late, so, um, yeah, I don't know what he thinks I'm doing right now, <laughs> what the hell, Pushahari, well, no, maybe, <laughs> if you look what we're up to, you can see that I am pushing, 
Well, to a great effect, because it'd be nice if we could get the minions whilst in it. Oh my god. Minions just dying. The pain and suffering caused. Um, I don't really want to actually just back yet, because we haven't got a great deal to buy. Um, obviously we lost out on a lot of CS because I went top. And we've even actually been out farmed by Jana, which is terrible. That's uh, really, really bad. Um, obviously we both waste as much time going to top, but still. Uh, shows you how my farming's not on par at the moment. We need to uh, sort that out. Let's say pushing then, you know, cost me quite a few minions, where it's poorly uh, done by me. So, I'm not sure if I'm gonna. I might just. Um, I was thinking about going, maybe going for Nafiens just for the mana regen, but I might just go straight into a DFG and just try and uh, have that burst potential. Once we get level 6, you know, I just want to try and be Roman. Uh, it might hurt my mana cost, or my mana bar a little bit by doing it, but we'll see. Um, see how we can do off on gold. We're looking alright. Um, it's just a shame we're missing all these minions. Every time I do a Q on her, it just costs me all the minions. Um, I don't know. I think we're looking cool. It's just a shame we didn't make anything happen, obviously, when uh, Yi come and, you know, she went top. You know, she did actually burn her exhaust, which is kind of cool, but at the same time, I oh, that was some nice damage. At the same time, I don't have my Q just yet to... Um, my Q, I don't know what I'm on about. My Ignite. I really need that Ignite to be uh, making the true potential, the big plays. We have my ult now, which is oh these minions. Oh god, no, 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 no. Don't hold back. No, but if we can make anything happen with that, that's another question. This Riven's doing really well. Um I'll tend to just go bot. As soon as Janet's recalling Riven's bot, I really shouldn't want to bounce down the backside, but um just the way it happened to go. Are we gonna make anything happen here? Yeah. I don't think we are, no. Bot's just. Bot didn't really, really react to me going in, and I didn't feel comfortable enough to just dive onto Riven on my own. Um, as much as I would have liked to, I just didn't feel. Oh, there she is. Oh, that wasn't good. She was waiting for me. She was waiting for me. Smart play by Riven. I should have really saw that coming, knowing that Janna was mission. They were going to roam over down like that. Um, we did some alright damage, obviously. Jinx, again, they just closed in quicker than what my bot did. Even though I don't think, even if my bot closed in on time, they'd have probably still come out top, so. Um, so, we buy a pink ward. Very slow star at the moment. Uh, again, hurts me in my farm department. And uh, my farm's not as good as well as it really should do, let alone having a fail gank bot and, you know, waste of time. Obviously, Janet did come down in the end, but she pushed all the wave under the turret during that hard time, which, you know, I lost all those minions, so. Kind of sucks. And not really a good start, because you can see her CS lead is now just rocketed because of that really failed gank. Um, well, it wasn't so much a fail. I think we did it. We were looking alright, but it was just. You know, bot didn't really react, or maybe they didn't feel they were in a position to react, I don't know. It's the way the cookie crumbles sometimes, and as I thought, you would take my blue buff. I wasn't surprised by that. That was one of the reasons I thought I'd go for the Athenes, but I knew you would take it. Them solo Q junglers. So, for the moment, obviously my ignite went down because we burned that on Riven. I was hoping to try and blow her up as quick as possible, but you know, the fact that she stunned me, I lost all that time drawing that, and... Uh, Jan and I knew Janna would then be coming down at this point and what obviously rotated and he had to burn my flash, but at least we got out. Just wanna keep delaying Janna for as long as possible. Um Even though I can't if I was to if I could delay her for another ninety seconds that would be uh lovely but I think it's gonna happen. Oh they the big minion. Big minion. That was a shame. I was really thinking about actually going in on her then, but... Let's see. Just want to keep... Uh, just pissing her off. I really want to get my charm off to see, because obviously if we get my charm off we do that a lot more damage, but... Let's see, she is getting lower and lower every time. Problem is we're getting closer and... Oh my god, that was a misclick. Um, we're getting closer and closer to her turret every time, which does mean that... Oh, Riven's dead, so that that's always a good thing, but it means if I, it's going to be hard to kill her because she's just, if I dive in on her, she's just going to ult um, me backwards. Oh, 
was weird. Jinx is, yeah, Jinx on there too. Don't know where that was. Ah, I guess it was going for River I see. So yeah, I really would like to, I feel that I could potentially maybe kill Janna, but at the same time, she has her ult, and I kind of know that, and she knows that, and, uh... Um... I drop my pink ward down and maybe go bot. They might think that's coming. Looks like they kind of know that's coming. It was a pretty obvious rotation from mid lane. At least we drop my pink ward down. It gives us some additional vision of their Riven. She hasn't actually... I haven't had the pleasure of meeting her in the mid yet. Um, so whether I want to go for my W or my E. I need to see, what it, see if it tells me if it's E. Oh my god, I don't think I've got a big minion yet. It's terrible. Alright, my charm... Duration. Yeah, it does last longer. I'll go for duration. I think we even had a chart. Oh no, we landed on Riven. I don't think I've landed on one on Janna yet. Um. Yeah. Just my farming. It's not as. Oh, everyone around me is dominating, but it's just a little newbie me who's uh, struggling. We are actually taking the CS lead, but still, it's nothing amazing. Um. Let's see if I can catch Riven out at all. She's probably gone. Oh yeah. Problem is, I don't think we're going to be able to make anything happen here. I kind of want to, but the thing is the wave's gone and Graze is not there. and It would probably end horribly. I'd probably dive in there and miss my charm and maybe a complete and fail. Much I'd like to, but... Um, so yeah, we'll see. At least was, we picked up my first kill, which was nice. But my Knight, we kept holding my ultimate. Um, I felt pretty comfortable that I'd be able to do the damage without my ultimate. Um, so, yeah, I think we're looking alright. We finally actually got a big one then. Unintended to. We finally did that. Did we get the charm? Oh, no. The thing is. Especially where I don't have blue buff and I'm running no affines, you know, my mana, every time I miss a skill shot, you know, it's pretty deadly on me. Oh, that was terrible. That was terrible. As soon as you miss the, miss the charm, it's just GG, really, isn't it? I'm going to come over here and I have no flipping mana. <laughs> I didn't have a mana to do my charm. <laughs> that was what I had mana for. Um, so yeah, a little bit of a fail in the mid. Um, but I think I have a second kill now, which is alright. I say I'm not an Ahari, an Ahari player. How would you pronounce Ari? Ahari? Ari, I think's right. How would you say Ahari? Ari or whatever. Sexy little mid laner. Um, so yeah, we're looking alright. Um, CS is still poor, you know, there's no reason why I can't be on what Riven is, but at the same time we're out farming Janna, but really Janna's not really causing me any issues, so um, you know, I should be out farming her, it's just where maybe not be paid enough attention. Oh, don't feed her, she's done well these plays. She could be in trouble now though. Oh, ain't she's in big trouble, what's she gonna do? What is she gonna do? She feeds Janna, of course. <laughs> How sucky is that? That damage there, yeah, well, we really see that damage starting to come through with that Nisi Large Rod now. Um, 100, you know, she's doing 200 T damage on the way back, that's ridiculous. That's, <laughs> that's some big damage. Big damage. So, ultimate's about to be back out. No ignite just yet. Riven is mostly taking her red buff. I think she'd be taking her red buff. It's probably gone. I was too busy watching that. Bottom drawing all of that. There we go. So, I think all my. Oh no. Two of my kills have been. No, no. I think all my. I'm trying to think how I got. I know two of my kills have definitely been over Riven. Um, don't know if I want to go as far as all three though. I can't remember. Oh, that was. It was t totally meant to do that for the minion. But again, you know, every time I do something like that, you know, I, without a blue buff, my my mana, I really struggle for mana. Um, you know, I failed Q there, and you know, well, that damage. 
fail Q there and I'm just down on mana completely now and it just it sucks. And if I'm trying to, if she's pushing me out where I have no HP now and you know I'm trying to use my Q to get the minion, again, you know, it just means I sit, sit here on no mana whatsoever. And that's the one downside from, or one not having blue or, you know, going down the Athens route, but I really wanted to go down the route of a, oh this could be me. That was a nice uh, tornado. Oh ye, where did ye even come from? I haven't really do much for ye to be honest. I would die. <laughs> I would die from anything. Um, once you can't afford boots, my pink ward did actually just get killed at Vigix and Alistar, but it lasted a long amount of time, and they walked through it a couple of times. He even died in the end. So we had the DFG. So this should really help um, increase my burst potential. You know, we're free now, reasonably fed. CS again's poor, but it, we're out farming Janna, but still. I don't know. Well, Janna's starting to cause me a bit of issue now. It was just really bad farming by me at the start of the game where I guess I wasn't fully focused and warmed up into things now, so. Should have no excuse. And all the big minions missed. That was, that was painful to watch. Well, GG. We should be able to get this turret. Risen. I was interested in Tara. I'm more interested in Riven now, even though she probably knows that I'm going to be coming. There we go. Do you need to use my key? <laughs> Mr. Charm. Um, uh, it's all good. Again, <laughs> we've literally just got fed off their Riven. Um, Owen Five. That's not been. <laughs> I, I think I I would say three kills have definitely been from me. Um, I don't know if all four, I really can't remember. But we finally have a blue buff, which is really nice because it means I can now just, you know, I can push the wave, and if I want to push the wave generally, I'd have to use my abilities to do it quickly because, you know, oh, attacking on a mid laner is a pretty painful process, so, uh. Oh, shit. I can do auto attacks. GG. Did have my DFG, completely forgot about that, actually. Nice charm. It's a bit of a late DFG, but it makes us unstoppable. Oh god, oh god, no, no, no. The clear up. Here comes Graves to the. He's gonna, he's gonna walk into the trap. Uh, there goes my flawless game. Um, you're greedy, really. I just wanted to trap my DFG onto Riven, and it was, you know, it was easy ult for Jinx to land, collateral damage. Um, Yes, yeah, one big ass Alistar. <laughs> don't want to be, don't want to be, be, don't want to be milking those. So we'll probably go into a daffy cap now, or even a uh, last, last whisper. Well, I don't know why I'm saying last whisper. It's an AD item, void staff. I get last whisper from losing my marbles. That's what's going on. Um, so yeah, looking cool. Shame we lost my double buff. We finally actually had a blue buff and it's gone, but it was fed. Um, Again, you know, I, I'm always quite critical of my farm because I think farm is so important. Obviously, on the mid lane, I always expect my farm to be a little bit less because um, I just haven't perfected the mid lane farm, I guess, where my attack damage is a lot less than it would say be in a top lane or AD carry. I'm not just kind of used to that. Um, and in the jungle, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> but we're cool. But definitely could, you know, probably could have had an easy 30 CS more, but at the same time, we made up with it for kills and it's looked good. It's a shame we lost my flawless game now. The, the first death's always the worst. It's always a death that can be avoided, or I guess every death can be avoided really if you had to be smart about it. Oh shit. Who's gonna get me or Graves? Me or Graves? Graves, you flipping kill stealer. I mean, you just did that. So yeah, looking good. Jan, I say Janon's caused no issues. The only kill she got was that one where Riven. <laughs> Unfortunately, got cornered, and I don't know. I was quite surprised that Janna still got the kill for that. It was quite a long, it was a long time since Janna did the damage, but I don't know. Maybe because enemies were in the air. I'm not sure. Anyway, we're looking. I think I actually did land my charm then, but I was. I uh, kind of wanted it. Kind of glad I didn't, because Lulu had her ultimate, so. Quite glad that I didn't actually go balls deep in the end. I was hoping that I'd do a lot more damage off my ultimate, but I didn't. The thing is, I didn't have my charm. Obviously, the charm increases the damage, but I used that on Jinx. 
So yeah, we're looking looking pretty strong. I'm actually enjoying Ari. Uh, say she's not really a champion that I pl or I've played much of, so I'm looking pretty strong. It's just a shame again, like not having that blue buff. It's really kind of slows down my whole game. Um, so there you go, GG. Not the greatest deal farming, a very quick game. <laughs> Pretty much got fed off just ribbon alone. Um, certainly some potential there with our Ari. Uh, just, um, I don't know, a lack of a bit bad farm at the start really didn't help. And Janna, I, I didn't really do much to Janna, but her shield kept her at bay. And I don't know, I, get, I really feel, again, getting down to the point where I feel I can't be that aggressive against her. Um, or until I get my DFG because of just my mana issues. Maybe I'm wrong on that, but. Uh, you know, with her shields and her, her, you know, she had her ultimate all the time, so I was always wary of that because she would just fling me backwards anyway. And then what do I do there? Because um, she's close to generally she'd be at her turret at that by that point. And don't know, it's just really nice, you know, having blue buff on a mid laner. I can't really stress that. I can't really stress that anymore, but, you know, solo queue junglers don't really care about that, and that's just the way the cookie crumbles, but, nevertheless, it was, it was a pretty good game, um, Riven fed me up, and that was GG, so, <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed, TZ, have a great day, peace.